Flexen or Peterson, who do we start game six? Hello? Speaking. Oh, yes, Doctor. Thank you for calling. How is Jacob de Grom? A sprained elbow. Okay, so what does that mean? About a week. About a week. Okay, so he still has a career then. Excellent news. His agent will be pleased. Hi, guys. I'm Ozzy Villain. Welcome to episode 44 of the New York Mets. But more importantly, it is game six of the World Series, and we can win this mofo today. We can win it all if we can get the win at Yankee Stadium. Now, as you just heard, the Jacob de Grom injury, it's not serious. Of course, he got taken out after, was it just over in innings, I think, uh, in game five. It's just day to day. It's a sprained elbow. Uh, when I saw it was a sprained elbow, I was initially a little bit concerned, to be honest, but... Um, no, it's fine. He's day-to-day. -day. We, technically, we could still pitch him, I think, if we wanted to, but uh, we won't be doing that because he's not been in the best form recently. So, this is it. This, th Well, this could be it anyway. This is how our, our pitching staff looks ahead of the game. Flexen is going to start this one. Everybody seemed to agree with me in the comments after last one. He's on a hot streak as well, which just adds to, the, I think, the obviousness of the whole decision. Um, we should be looking at Syndergaard to go in a game seven, should that be the case. Uh, but we'll worry about that, should we have to get there. You can see the bullpen is actually not in a bad uh, not in a bad state. We had, uh, I think it was two days off after game five. Or was it one day? There's an easy way to check. We can have a look. Uh, so this is the second, uh, and so we've had one day off. But anyway, uh, you can see the bullpen's recovered quite well. Um, so relatively fresh. We can call on pretty much anybody, but uh, yeah. Oh, I'm so nervous, guys. Let's have a look at the team we're sending out, the heroes that could get the job done for us. Now, of course, we go back to the designated hitter. So this is our lineup. Jeff McNeil leads off and plays at second base. Ebert Morlock, uh, he plays at third and bats second. Dominic Smith comes back in to be the DH at number three. Um, my boy Blue continues to clean up and play first base. Juan Mayora uh, plays in left field and bats five. Big Willie Ramos is the catcher and bats six. Treadmill bats seven and plays in center field. Luis Gamore bats eight and is in at shortstop. And Michael Conforto, he is in right field. He will bat number nine. And it is Chris Flexen that goes on the mound. And their pitcher today is uh, Jonathan uh, Nicaragua. Uh, how would you say that? Liao uh, C. Anyway, that name there. Um, you can see he's decent. Uh, he's pitched the three, he's 33 starts this year. An ERA of 3.2, whip of 1.23. Um, so he's decent. It's decent. It's going to be a big challenge, this one. Today's game is proudly brought to you by God. If you have one, pray to him, because we do not want a Game 7. God, a sports fan's best friend. What I'd like to do here is just get a nice, just like last game, a nice eight-run lead in the first three innings, and then we can all just sit back and relax, basically. Um, somehow, I'm not sure that's going to be the case, but we can win it all today, guys. I am really, really nervous ahead of this one. Um... Obviously, we will bat first, being the away team. McNeil leads us off with a walk. Excellent stuff. Excellent stuff, mate. All right. That's going to bring up to the plate Ebert Morlock. What can he do for us? He's hit. They hit that quite well. That's going to leave us. That's going to leave us. Oh, Ebert Morlock. We've got on the way. We are on fire lately. Two runs, none out, and it's still the top of the first. Excellent stuff. Just give it to us now, boys. Just give us the World Series. We're going to win it anyway. What a piece of hitting from Ebert Morlock. Wow, that's excellent stuff. His fourth home run of the postseason as well. And now it's Dominic Smith. Can he pile on the misery? Or will he strike out? Oh, he's piled on the misery. What a piece of hitting. That is against the shifty thing. And he's going to go in with a double. And we have not got it out yet. Bring on Blue. He will almost certainly strike out because that's what he does. But that's a really good hit, wasn't it? Against the... Was it like, not a pull hit, was it like a slap? I don't know, I can't remember what the term is now. But he's hit it the opposite side, and now it's blue. To continue to pile on the misery, will he strike out? Yes, he will. That's what blue does. Well done, mate. Well done. Playing up to form. We don't want to brag too early here. All right, it's Juan Mayora. He's hit that back up the middle. That's going to get Smith to third. Is he going to beat the throw? No, he's not. We're two out. A runner on third. It's going to be Big Willie Ramos. Can he drive in a third run of the first innings? No, he cannot. But I tell you what, boys, that is the sort of start we were looking for. We've given Flexen something to work with, and here we go. Here we go with Christy Flexen. Come on, mate. He's gone the early bunt. That is should be out, surely. We've gone the throw, and he's bunted his way on. Who does that, honestly? Come on. All right, that's a none out. Runner on first. He's quick, so they will probably try and steal him around. We've got to be aware of that. Flexen strikes out Stanton. Have some of that, mate. All right, that's one away. Aaron Judge now. We can end this innings with a double play. 
or he could tie it with a home run. That's going to be caught out there, though, by... Oh, it's a stunning catch by Mayora. Keeps the runner at first as well. Excellently done. And it's Gary Sanchez. Now, he is he's on fire, as they say in NBA Jam. He's hit that, and that's going to tie the game. Mayora's there. Oh, and it's left. And it's 2-2. Two -two. Just like that, our lead is gone. Only just got over two, didn't it? All right, come on, Flexen. Let's get rebound from that, mate. There we go. All right. It's nil-nil. We'll just pretend it's nil-nil, that we didn't blow a lead, and we'll go again. It's treadmill to the plate. What's he got for us? It's decent hit. It's not going to quite know. Just thought it might be in an area there we could beat the throw, but wasn't to be. It's Louis Gomore. Of course, he was, went three for four. I've got a cat hair up my nose. Uh, game five. He's hit that. Has he got it through? No, not quite. And... There we go. That is the second out. It brings up Conforto. He's our free hit. What's he going to do for us? He strikes out. That's what can happen. That's what can happen. Uh, 20 strikeouts in the postseason. Um, all right. We go again with Flexen. Come on, mate. He was really good in game two. You just wonder if this is the game too many. This cat hair up my nose is going to do my head in. Honestly, it's destroying the game for me right now. All right. None out, one on. This is what we can't do. We know the Yankees can hit home runs. We don't want to be giving them base runners as well. That could be a double play. That should be a double play. That is a double play. There we go. There we go. Boy, you want Yankees fans. It's a double play. All right. It's Enrique Hernandez now. Come on, Flexi. Back up the middle. Oh, it gets through. I thought for a second. Mayor, uh, what's his name? Gamore. It's too many Spanish names for my poor, uh, uh, what's it called, Anglo-Saxon brain to get around. All right. Again with the runner on. It's Eric Thompson to the plate. He's hit that. That's been popped up. Any one of five guys could make that catch. It looks like it's going to be blue. No, it leaves it for McNeil, and he does make the play. And we get out of that. That's good to see. Good to see. Not the most convincing innings, but we did, as I said, get out of it, and that's the main thing. Jeff McNeil to lead us off again. He's hit that back up the middle, and that's just a little grubber thing to the pitcher, and that is the first out. Morlock, who, of course, sent a ball out of the stadium first time up. Can he do something similar here, please? He's hit that back up the middle, and it does get through. Ebert Morlock, he wants to be, I'm assuming, the first German to win a World Series. I don't, I mean, as I said last time before, there's always one that's done it before, but... Yeah, I don't know there have been too many Germans that have done it. All right, Smith with a, a wonderful hit last time up down to left field. Can he do something similar here? That's a double play ball, isn't it? Oh, Morlock can't quite break it up, and that is a double play. Have we got all our, uh, <laughs> all our good hitting done in the first innings? Got overexcited. I know I certainly didn't get overexcited, uh, and are we going to live to regret that? All right, Flexen. That's a hit. Blue's got that all day. Flexen's over to the base, and that is the four. Did he beat it? I think he beat it. He did beat it. Oh, unlucky. That's, that's, that. Yeah, he's quick, isn't he? All right, it's Stanton. He's got good power. We've got a runner on. Flexen, that could be a double play. Can we turn it? No, we just get the one. Probably sensible. That's fine. Good play by Morlock over at third base there. It brings up Aaron Judge. And again, this guy's dangerous, isn't he? Flexen, it's a ground ball to shortstop. Holds the runner at second. Gets the out at first. Perfectly done. Textbook. Textbook play by Gomore. All right, that's two away. Can we get ourselves out of this? It's Gary Sanchez, the man that's on fire. Oh, he's hit that well. It's Morlock. He gets it over the first. There we go. There we go. Good stuff. We go into the fourth. Still tied at two. Come on. All right. It's my boy Blue leading us off. This is where he tends to hit home runs, where he doesn't get many RBIs to go with it. That's a well-hit ball, but he's the slowest man alive, and he's not going to get the first on that one. Unlucky. It brings up Juan Mayora. What's he got for us? He hits that. He's popped it up, though, and that eventually will come down and almost certainly land into the glove of a Yankee. There we go. Two outs. Uh, Big Willie Ramos. He doesn't have a double play to hit into, so we just might do something productive here. He's hit that straight to shortstop, and that's... Oh, is he going to beat it? Well done. It, Willie Ramos isn't quick either, so he's done well to get the first base on that one. All right, can Treadmill do something wonderful for us? He's hit that down the third baseline. A little bit unlucky, actually, that didn't get uh, didn't get through. But that ends the innings for us. Just the one infield hit let's go with for Big Willie Ramos. And it is flexing to go back to work. There's a strikeout for you. All right. Hicks is sitting back down. It's Voigt. What can he do? 
That's been hit, and it's going to get into left field. It's another base runner. Oh, it makes me nervous, the base runners. All right, one out. Can we get a double play from Escobar? He's hit that. Blue's going to field that. Back to your base, mate. Can we turn the double? No, but we get the lead runner. That's all right. That's what we wanted, boys. That's fine. Two out. Get the man at the plate, and it is job done. It's Enrique Hernandez. Now, he has hurt us before in this postseason. He's hit that. That should be easy enough for Morlock, and that is the end of the innings. We are through four innings now, still tied at two. And it looks as though both pitchers have kind of settled into the game a little bit. Unfortunately, they're going a little bit more than ours. Gomore's hit that, but it's straight to second base, and that is a pretty incredible catch, apparently. So unlucky there for Gomore. Conforto, our free hit. Close your eyes, have a swing, and probably strike out. Oh, he's hit that. He's hit that really, really well. I think that's going to leave us. That ball is going to land in Boston. Hey! Conforto gives us back the lead. He strikes out or he hits home runs. That's what he does. He struck out first time around, and obviously it was this turn that to hit a home run. There we go. 3-2. That shuts the Yankees fans up, and we're back to top of the order with McNeil. Come on, Jeffy boy. He's hit that. That's going to end the innings, but that's all right. We have the lead back, and can we hang on to it this time? That is the big question, isn't it? Well done to Michael Conforto. Oh, no, we're still going. We're still going. I'm ahead of myself. It's Ebert Morlock. He's hit that. Now we're out of the innings. I was just thinking, you know, we give, we give them a chance. Give them a chance. We're just toying them along here. That now... Oh, excuse me. I am really excited, aren't I? That now ends the innings, and it is Flexen up against Eric Thomas. What can he do here? He's hit that straight to blue. Oh, straight through blue. Blue's playing tunnel ball. And that is a runner on with none out. That's not ideal. Base runners again. They have power and it makes me nervous. Come on, Flexi. Oh, he's walked him. Oh, and we're into like the meat of their order too, aren't we? This could this could be bad. All right, come on, Flexi. Rebound, mate. Concentrate. He's hit that. That's popped up. Mayor is there. I think he's going to try and tag, but it's not deep enough. Surely, if he goes, we're going to get him at third. Oh, ho, ho, that was stupid, wasn't it? That was really stupid. You could have had plenty of time to turn around and go back. Suddenly, it's two out, and the, the, the Yankees are throwing it away. It's Aaron Judge. He's hit that. It's Oh, it's well picked up by, May, uh, by uh, keep calling him Mayor. It's uh, Guamore, obviously. That ends the innings, and I tell you what, that looked a bit shifty, but we ended up getting out of that okay. They've changed their pitcher. It's a right-hander still. It's Jonathan Holder. He pitched 72 games, 108 innings, an ERA of just under four and a half, a whip of just over one and a half. Decent though, isn't he? So he's not the worst. It's Dominic Smith to go against him. Two strikes, no balls. I sense a strikeout, but you never know. He's hit that. It's back up towards second base, and that will be the end of that. That brings Bluey up for the strikeout. Come on, Blue. Come on, mate. Yeah, here he goes again. He just... Yeah. He's just not having a good time of things, is he? And it is Juan Mayora. He's hit that back up the middle. But that is going to be the end of the innings. Does this... If this goes to a game seven, do I do the unthinkable and drop Blue? Oh, it's, it's, it's getting to that point, isn't it? Um, all right. It's... Was it Sanchez? Man on fire. He's hit that. Blue is there. Makes the catch. And that is the end of him. Aaron Hicks now. Flexen is... He's doing okay, isn't he? I don't want to jinx him, but he's doing okay here. Right, right. It is. There it is. Another strikeout for the Flexmeister. We send him back. Voigt comes up. He is... What's Voigt doing today? Two for two, isn't he? So we need to end that, please. We've walked him. We're giving base runners. I don't like it, boys. I don't like it. It's Escobar... He's 0 for 2. Like to keep that off. We can. We've hit him. Oh, Flexen. Come on, mate. You, he's not going to keep getting away with these mistakes, is he? It's Enrique Hernandez who killed us in game 2. And we struck him out. There we go. Have a seat, boys. Have a seat. Oh, we're into the 7th. We're 3-2 up. And suddenly we're 9 out to way. It's Big Willie Ramos. What can he do for us here? Come on, Big Willie. He's hit that. He's hit that quite well. I don't think it's going to leave. It's just a little bit too high. Just for a second there, it looked good. But it is the first out of the seventh innings. Treadmill comes up now. He hasn't had a walk yet today. He struck out. That's uh, not the best. 20 strikeouts for Nimmo this postseason. And it brings Luis Gomore with two outs. Just swing for the fences, mate. Have a go. He's hit it. He's hit it quite well. But it's not. It's too loopy, isn't it? 
and it ends the innings for us. We stretch with a 3-2 lead. I'm starting to feel a little bit sick with nerves right now. Can we do this? Justin Wilson comes in for Flexen. Well done, Flexen. Six innings, two runs given up. That's quite good. Can Now, Wilson can be slow to start. What's he going to do for us here? He's a lefty, of course. It's been hit. It's been hit quite well. Treadmill's there. I think he's going to make the play. Oh, it's a stunning catch by Treddy. Well done out there. That is a great catch to keep the uh, bases clean. Wilson goes again now against Florial, the leadoff man. That's a strikeout by good old Wilson there. All right, and it is Stanton. He has the power, doesn't he? He is a really, really dangerous man. Come on, Wilson. Sit him down, mate. Sit him down. He sits him down. All right. We're into the last two innings here. We still have a one-run lead. Conforto, please, can you add to your home run tally? It would really settle the nerves a little bit for me here. Michael Conforto, he's hit that, but he's popped it up, and that will be a catch out there in center field. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Back to the top of the order. It's Jeff McNeil again. Jeff McNeil is 0 for 2 today. He got a walk in the first innings. He hasn't done much else. He's been hit that time. That's absolutely disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. He's in pain. It's his left knee. He's able to shake it off. He's tough, old McNeil. All right. Come on, Morlock. We've got a new pitcher. It's Ben Heller. He looks... No, he's, he's going to get some strikeouts, but he's going to let some guys go as well, isn't he? 44 games, 55 innings pitched, three and a quarter, quarter yeah, uh, ERA. One and just over one and a quarter, uh, 1.25, whoever you want to say it. Uh, whip. Can Morlock get the better of him here? He's hit that. He's hit that really well. Get out of here. It's his second home run, is it? No, it's going to be caught. Oh, so unlucky from Morlock. I thought that was gone, which is why I got excited, obviously. All right, it's Dominic Smith. What can he do? We've got two out. Oh, it's a pass four. There we go. McNeil goes to second. Runner in scoring position for Dominic Smith. It's 2-0. and oh. It's a hitter's count. Can he do something magnificent here? He's hit it. It's popped up, though. That's going to end it. Easy play by the second baseman. And we go to the bottom of the eighth. Still with that 3-2 lead. It's Aaron Judge. Oh, he doesn't like a lefty, does he? He'll probably still hit a home run. But come on, Wilson, mate. Come on. Oh, he's walked in. Oh, and the go-ahead run comes to the plate. The last thing we wanted was base runners. Oh, and it's Sanchez. It's man on fire with the power as well. Come on, Wilson. Oh, are we watching the game slip away from us here? Come on, Wilson. We brought on Edwin Diaz to try and rescue this. It's Hicks to the plate. We need an out. We need a double play. We need something. Strikes him out. All right, there we go. A double play now can end this for us. Come on, Diaz. It's Voigt. He's hit it. Is that our double play ball? It's just the one. All oh, right, that's fine. That's fine. All right, boys. Two out. Runners at second and third. A hit here kills us. Come on, Diaz. Please. He's hit it. It's going to get through. Oh, no. We're going to be behind. Throw it home. Throw it home. We haven't thrown it home and we're behind. Oh, we've been absolutely... It's 4-3. We're behind. We've only got three outs to rescue this. Oh, Diaz. It's Wilson's fault. And now it's a pass ball. Oh, we were so, so close. It's going to be Blue to lead off the ninth. He's going to strike out. And, oh. Come on, Diaz. He's hit it. I think Treadmill's going to make the play. He does. But the damage has been done. Wilson just did not. You can't walk your first two batters. Presley comes out for them. I'm assuming it's their closer. It's going to be their gun guy. He's at 84 innings, 2.68 ERA, whip of 1.23. Blue, come on, mate. He's going to strike out, isn't he? It's all he's done all day. He walks. Okay, okay. All right, it's a base runner. He's the man's world's slowest man, though. Can we pinch run him, maybe? Juan Mayora, just don't hit into a double play, mate. Come on. He's hit that. He's got that down the line. All right, come on. We're still alive in this. Can Bluey get the third? I think he can. It's going to be a double. We're none out. Runners at second and third. And we can still... We're still in this game. We're still fighting for this, boys. Come on. Come on. It's Big Willie Ramos. He can't hit into a double play, which is amazing. If he can get a base hit, Mayora's got pace. He can score. Come on, Big Willie. 
He's hit it. He's got it through. He's got it through. Juan Mayor is going to go for home. Don't get thrown out, mate. Slay, we've taken the lead. We've taken the lead. We've taken it back. Go on, boys. Big Willie Ramos with a big hit. Come on, Treadmill. He's hit that back up the middle and it's going to be caught, is it? Oh, unlucky for Treadmill. Unlucky. What can Guamore do here? What can he do? Come on. He's... Oh, it's a double play. It's a double play. Guamore, you've let us down, mate. It's all right. We've taken the lead. Come on, Mets. We're three outs away. We're three outs away. Come on. Diaz to continue to... And where are we? At the bottom of their order. Oh, it's going to come back to the top. We need the first three outs because now it starts to get... We need, we need the first two outs anyway. They only need a run, of course. One swing of the bat can still kill us here. It's popped up. It's going to be easy for Big Willie Ramos. Oh, have we made our... We've made our defensive subs, haven't we? So Sanchez is behind the plate now. Uh, so you can see, yeah, we've, we've made our defensive subs. Um, all right, come on, Diaz. Come on, mates. Come on. Oh, no, 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 no. What has gone wrong with Diaz? We've made our defensive subs. We've lost a lot of our attacking batting power. And Diaz has absolutely choked this game. Absolutely choked to pieces. I'd take him off now. You've, if we lose this because of Diaz, honestly, I'm going to sack him on the spot. Why strike him out now, mate? What a pointless strikeout that is. Oh, this game is too much. I can't do this. Come on, it's Judge. He's hit that. It's picked up by Guamore. And we go to extra innings yet again because we can't hold a friggin' lead. Oh, that is heartbreaking. All right, Michael Conforto, what can he do? Well, our batting is absolutely shot now. Um, I'm almost tempted to take off defensive subs because it's happened every time. We've made defensive subs, and then we get... Look at this. Ahmed Rosario leading off. He's not. He can't hit a right-hander. We've lost Jeff McNeil for that. Oh, I'll tell you what, he can hit a right-hander. Go on, Ahmed Rosario. I take it all back. I take it all back. One out, runner on first. It is Ebert Morlock. He's had a decent day. They've changed it. Now, this is their starter. This is their starter from last game. He's absolutely knackered. They, they, obviously, they're, it's do or die for them. They don't really care. But Ebert Morlock's had a decent day here. Can he continue? We've gone the steal. Rosario's going to be thrown out. It's not what's needed, guys. It's not what's needed. All right, Morlock. We're two out now. Just swing for the fences, mate. Oh, I've got a bad feeling about this game all of a sudden. He's hit that. He's hit that pretty well, but it's going to be caught out there. And there it is. I don't understand why we... I mean, I know it's to avoid, get a runner in, in scoring position. I get the double play. I know all that, but I just... Why are we still pitching Diaz? Honestly, get him off the friggin' field. I don't understand. Like, his, job, his, his job's done. He's, he's ruined it for us. He's a closer. He's pitching a third innings. We're gonna, we might need him for a game seven. Crab, get him off the field, mate. He's got to be, he's not quite knackered, but still, at this point, what's the point of leaving him out there? He's clearly having a bad day, and Hicks set the American playoff record, five strikeouts in a game. Well done, Hicks, you're a clown. All right, come on, Diaz, just end this. There we go. All right, it's too late now. I don't know why you bother striking them out now. It's pointless. But there we go. All right, we go to an 11th innings. It's Dominic Smith. He's hit that. Oh, it's popped it up, though. Oh, it sounded good off the bat. It's gone a long way. The distance traveled by that ball probably sends it halfway to Philadelphia. But, unfortunately, most of that distance was straight up. All right, it's Blue to strike out. Come on, Bluey. Do something, please. We've got to drop him, don't we? If there's a game seven, he can't play. Uh, it's that simple. Juan Mayora. Two out. What's he got for us? He can strike out as well. Oh, we go to the bottom of the 11th. Diaz is still... Why is Diaz pitching? Can I... I can't... Crab, listen to me, mate. Get him off the friggin' mound. He's knackered as well. I don't understand. Unless we're looking for a left-right. But we only have... He's safe as well. It's an infield hit. Oh, hooray! We've taken him off the mound. Well done. It's familiar now. Come on, mate. This could be... His last appearance as a Met, because we don't... Hopefully we won't need him if there's... Hopefully we won't need him. Hopefully there won't be a Game 7. But if there is a Game 7, hopefully we won't need it. That's been absolutely crushed into the gap, and that might even score a runner, you know. That could win it for him. Get it in, Nimmo. Get it in. It's not... It's not, is it? Oh, he's held at third. None out. Runners at second and third. 
and it's not looking good. We, this, I mean, we need a strikeout, don't we? It needs to be a strikeout. Come on, Familiar. It's infield. We've got the out at first. All right, that's one away. Oh, this is this is not a good situation, is it? All right, it's Floreal against Familiar. We've walked him. I guess that makes sense. Uh, because it doesn't matter if they a home run that we lose if they score one run. So at least we get the force at the plate. It's Juan Carlos Stanton. He's got power, but again, a power doesn't matter because it. There we go. All right. All right. Come on, Familiar. That is a huge strike. And it's Aaron Judge. Oh, it's, there's one man we'd rather not be facing it be him, wouldn't it? Come on. This needs to be an out. It gets the out. No, he walked him. No, he did get the out. I did, <laughs> for a second then. I did, should have just looked at that. We would have seen it. was. A, they couldn't have walked him. Anyway, we go to the 12th. How did we get out of that mess? It's Ali Sanchez. This guy is not a major league hitter. Yet here we are. And he strikes out. Oh, it's a defensive subs. It's going to kill us. It's Treadmill. What can he do? Oh, Treadmill. That's a good hit. That should be at least a double. Go on. Get the second, mate. Head first. Slide. Get in there. There we go. All right. Treadmill with a huge, huge hit for us. One out. Runner at second. I don't know who's up next. Is it... Gormore still there. All right, Gormore, come on. They've got a new pitcher. It's Chad Green. Let's have a look at him. Uh, he is 72 games, 80-odd innings pitched, 3.9 ERA, 1.21 whip. Oh, come on, Gormore. Come on, mate. Let's base a good hit. A nice, solid outfield hit here could put us back in front. He's got it down the third base, but that's not going to do anything. That just is two outs now. Who's up next? It's, oh, it's Michael Conforto. All right, come on, mate. Please, I beg of you. I beg of you. They've walked him. So that brings up Ahmed Rosario. Oh, we, well, he got a hit first time around, but he, he's not hes not a hitter. He can't hit right-handers. We're pushing our luck, asking for a second hit from him. He's got that. And that ends the innings. Oh, and I tell you what, after the stress of last time out, I'm not sure I can handle this again. Come on, Familiar, let's just get a nice one, two, three innings and begin the lucky 13th. That's hits. It's there for Morlock. Morlock's dropped it. We make all the defensive subs and we still can't field a ball <laughs> third base. All right, it's Avian now that comes in. He hasn't pitched much this postseason, to be honest. I'm a little bit, oh, this is not good. He's solid, obviously, without being outstanding. It's back up. No, it's popped up. That's fine. That's one away. Well done, Avian. All right, it's Park. It's back up the middle. That could be a double play. That could be a double play. Can we can't quite turn it. We've got the lead man, though. That's all right. That's okay. That's okay. All right, come on. Let's end this, please. Oh, it's going to get through. It's going to get through. We hold him at second. Oh, it's Enrique Hernandez. I can't handle this. Come on, Evian. Oh, it's gotten through. It's going to score. It's going to score the run. Oh. We'll be back for game seven on Friday. I do not understand how we've managed to find a way to lose that game. It goes to a game seven. Will we want it any other way, really, I guess? Um... Oh, but oh, how can Diaz and Wilson between them? I cannot believe what's happened. They've been two of our better pitchers all season long, and I don't. Oh, I'm. It's. It's. I, I'm, I'm sure you. I'm just. I don't know what to say. Anyway, we'll be back for Game Seven. Syndergaard will be on the mound. He'll be a little bit fitter than that, but hopefully we'll get a sort of our five odd innings out of him again. The bullpen looks a little bit knackered after that, but. Oh, we've hurt. But that, that's actually really, really hurt us because we've gone through our whole bullpen. I don't know why Diaz pitched seven innings. That was ridiculous. But anyway, we'll be back on Friday for game seven. We go again, boys. Basically, we just go again. Um, yeah. All right. Anyway, I don't know what to say. So I'm just going to end it here. I've been Aussie Villain. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Take care.